Welcome to my channel SB Quotes. I've always loved life, irrespective of all the ups and downs that have filled my journey. I believe in one power, and that is the hand of God. I respect all religions. As a singer, you have to bring the soul to the song. I feel I am a little unfit for the kind of music that is being made today. There is a big difference between what I sang earlier and what is being made now. I am not saying this music is bad, but there are too many beats. I missed out on my childhood. I had to work hard, but I was immediately given a place in playback. My father passed away in 1942, and three four months after his death, I had to start working. There was a responsibility on my shoulders to run the household. It was my duty as the eldest child in the house. I have decided that I won't take up assignments that don't interest me. The privileged classes today are bothered about petrol and diesel prices while the poor can't afford two meals a day. I am a very small person, but I want us to think beyond personal and regional interests. When I started out, there was so much work that I couldn't think of doing anything else. I would go for recordings by 8.30 am, that, too, in trains. I used to come home at night. I was traveling alone everywhere. I appreciate the change associated with people's growth, but I don't like the changes in our lives. I came to Mumbai in 1945, so imagine my acceptance of the massive changes around. I have witnessed every kind of revolution. Nowadays, there are seven music directors in one film. I had never heard of such a thing before. If one of our old music directors was told to share a score with others, he would have left the assignment. Today, the scope for variety has shrunk drastically. There are only a handful of top-notch composers like A.R. Rahman, Anu Malik, Jatin Lalit. That's it. I wish I had given more time to learning classical singing. For me, awards are a token of respect that people are giving me. So, no matter how many awards I am receiving, I always feel emotional. In my opinion, the biggest achievement was by Shankar Jakashan. With Raj Kapoor's Bassett, they changed the way we looked at playback singing. From my experience and understanding, I believe money follows name and fame, while recognition calls for a huge amount of sacrifice. To get something, you have to lose something. That's the rule of life. One has to be fully committed to one's career. Otherwise, there's no point. I really liked Kishore Kumar. He had a virile man's voice, and he was truly versatile. I think playback singing has a lot to do with voice acting. I would suggest to all the youngsters to understand the character, situation, and the story behind the songs. That is when you can add soul to the rendition which, I think, is missing in today's music. I feel God has sent me to earth to sing. I started singing when I was five, but I don't think I've worked as hard as many other people. I have been singing for the last 50 years, you know, so I deserve a break. Besides, there are talented singers around who can do justice to their work. I have a fierce temper. I've mastered it over the years, but when I'm angry, no one can force me to do anything I don't want to. I wouldn't let a biopic be made on me. That's because I don't believe in them. I don't like them. People, who accused me of practicing a monopoly were wrong. The media fueled rumors about my monopoly. The first question I was always asked, during interviews was about my supposed monopoly. There are so many songs that I could not sing the way I wanted to. When such songs come on television or radio, I shut them off or leave the room. Thanks so much for your watching. God bless you.